and welcome back for another tips and tricks video brought to you by Absident and Acer. And in today's video, we are going to take a look at the brand new Smart Chips, which are part of the new Google Smart Canvas. Now, these Smart Chips are currently available in Google Docs and will be coming to Sheets soon. And they can allow you to pull from different places and connect it all together in one Google document and they allow you to tag things in different ways. So let's take a look at these three brand new ways to integrate things into a single Google document. Now, the first thing you can do is you can pull multiple documents and link them directly into your working document. All you have to do is start typing. So here in my document, I've got a statement that says, use at least one link from the resources provided. Well, I can go ahead and connect the resources right here that I want. All I do is I start typing at first, and you'll notice what pops up is people, files, and dates. None of these are what I'm looking for, but I know the name of my file, so I'm just gonna start typing it. And now you can see the files being listed have changed to reflect any that have that ancient word in there. So if I go ahead and click ancient Greece, because that's what I want it to be, it puts that link directly in there. Again, I didn't have to go find it. I didn't have to copy the link. I just typed it directly into the document I'm working on. But if I give this a click, it acts just like a hyperlink. It shows me that preview. I can give it a click and then it opens that presentation there for viewing. So that second thing you saw when I type at is people. Now this is a great way to pull people into a document that you are working on or to assign them to do something or to pull up all of their contact information because you might need it. So you can see here, the people I contact most are on this list. I'm gonna go ahead and choose a account here for Ron Weasley. And you'll notice what happened when I added him in, I get this pop-up on the side that says, he's not had this shared with him, do I want to do that? And I can just click that button, click share, and it will share this document with him if I don't want to, if this is notes to myself, I can just go ahead and click dismiss. Now, here's the cool thing about pulling that person in is it pulls all of their contact information from your contacts list. And now if I click the name, I can see the email. I can send an email to him by clicking on it. It gives me a pop-up to create an email and automatically addresses it to this person. I can send a message through chat. I can start a video call and immediately pull in this person I've tagged. I can also schedule an event and if I click this it opens up my calendar and you'll notice it automatically tags both myself and that person in this event that I am creating. And then of course I go through the process, I click save, and it'll then be on my calendar and send the invite to him as well. And then of course I can click and get more info and then it opens up in contacts and I can see any other information I have in there for that person. And then the third thing you can do is you can add a date. And again, you type your at, you'll see dates appearing down at the bottom. Today's date, tomorrow's date, it lets you choose what it's going to look like. Or if I just want to create the date myself, I can start typing and it starts filling it in and then I can have a specific date for something to happen. So I can say this is when it needs to occur. I can have it as a due date of sorts. Again, this will integrate more with updates still to come in Smart Canvas, but for now, if I give it a click, I have those 
same options to immediately book a meeting, schedule an event, and it will pull it up on my calendar. So these are three really exciting things to come out recently to add to your Google Docs working experience, to make it more seamless, to make it more integrated, to make it more collaborative. And that is the whole goal of their new Smart Canvas. And so these Smart Chips are just one part of it that are super user-friendly and they are available for you to explore starting. I hope this helped you and we'll see you back next time for more tricks.